Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Adam Bilson, and this is Dirty Bandana Music. Today, we're doing an unboxing, opening, whatever you want to call it, of a DW5000 series throne. So this thing comes in two options. You can see on the cover here, the one I got is the round one that I'm pointing at. It's a 5100 series, I believe. I have one of these bicycle seat shaped ones uh, already in the studio, and I've decided that I don't really like it anymore, which is why I wanted to get the round one. That bicycle seat shaped one has moved down a notch in importance and is now sitting on my practice pad kit. So this is the 5100, like I was saying. Not much really information on this box. It just sort of says what it is over and over again. Um, I always really like DW Thrones. They hold up really well in my experience and they don't get wobbly over time. Uh, in my past especially, I had a habit of sitting really far out on the front of the throne and uh, that would like wear them out really quickly because everything was sort of off kilter and out of balance and stuff like that. But I've improved my balance, you know, some amount, but these DW Thrones, uh, in my experience, even put up with it when I'm when I'm leaning on it extra hard. So it's all kind of conventional, just like you think. These are not, uh, they're not a large throne. Like it's, uh, I'm not sure what the diameter of it actually is, but it's not, it's not huge. So it comes with the top part, of course. And then in this other box is uh, the hardware bit. Just like you would expect the two pieces you get with pretty much every throne. Um, in case you forgot, I forget all the time. I think everybody kind of forgets the part of this throne with all of the corkscrew threads in it that you can see once you make it taller. That thing's covered in oil, just like most thrones, covered in oil. I'm sure that if you're a drummer, you have forgotten about a million times, just like I have. At some point in making this video, I grabbed onto that thing and had, you know, like stripes of black oil on my hands. So heads up for that in case you forget, I forgot. Anyway, there's the two pieces. Pretty much what you would expect. Boom, there it is, open. The tripod's nice and wide and sturdy, which I think is part of the reason I like these. Um, once you get it set up, it doesn't really move around very much. Then that thing goes right on the top, just like you would expect. There's a little, uh, there's a little cutout in that post that it goes on to, so once you screw in the wing nut, it's really locked in there. So even if the wing nut loses a little bit, the throne, the top part of the throne is not going to come off. Uh, the wing nut would have to back out like a whole quarter inch before you're at any risk of that thing coming off there. And uh, there it is, in all its glory. That's pretty much it. All there is is that one tag on it. As you can see, the tag jumps off of its own accord. Um, and there it is, the DW5100 series throne. I like these a lot. They're great thrones. Um, very much would recommend. If you want to learn some more about it or maybe pick one of these up for yourself, go ahead and check out the links in the description below. I'd also like to thank my friends and partners over at Red 11 Media for producing this video along with all the rest of my YouTube content. If you want to catch up with me and see what I'm up to, you can follow me on Instagram at Dirty Bandana. And you can get all the details for all my projects on my website at dirtybandana.com. That's it for now. We'll see you all next time.